Kitchen. I'm Julia and in this episode I'm showing you how to make delicious Oreo donuts. So let's get going. I will use the Oreo cookie for the dough and then I will save the cream for the glaze and then I will crush some whole Oreos for the top. So for my Oreo donuts I'll be using some of the butter, flour, whole milk, sugar, eggs, salt, vanilla extract and some dry yeast. And here I have some crushed Oreos for the top when my donuts are done. And here I have the cookie of the Oreos. And what I do is just to open an Oreo. That didn't go so well. And then I simply just scrape the cream out. Like that. And over here I have my cream for the glaze. So first step is to cross my Oreo cookies. And I'll crush them until they have a sand consistency. Just like that. I'm just going to mix my flour with my crushed Oreo cookies and my sugar and my salt. Just give it a quick stir. And in this bowl here, I will be adding in my dry yeast and then I will be adding in my lukewarm milk. And I will just let it sit there for around 5 minutes before the next step. In another bowl here, I will be adding in my eggs and my melted butter. And my little extract. And now I'll just add in all of my wet ingredients to my flour and Oreo mix. And then my milk and yeast mix here. And I'll just give it a good stir on low for about 10 minutes before the next step. So my Oreo dough is now done in my machine and I'll just scrape it down. And then I will set it aside to rise for about one hour before the next step. So I have my dough on the table here and I will just knead it a little and it is done rising after one hour. And now I'll just roll out my donut dough until it's around two centimeters thick. And I'll just take my donut cutter here and just dip it in some flour and then Squeeze it through here. Like that. Like that. And I have a baking sheet ready here with some baking paper on and I will just place them on here. Like that and now I'll just assemble my dough again and roll out one more time and make some more donuts. So I have 14 donuts here on this sheet and 7 on another one. I just collect the dough, roll it out, 
made some more donuts, collected the rest of the dough, rolled it out again and made some more donuts and I kept doing that until there were no more dough left. And yeah, I will now cover them up and let them rise for about a half an hour before frying them. So I have my oil already heated at 180 degrees C and right next to my fryer here I have a rack with a lot of paper towels on to put my donuts on when they are done. And I'll just place two donuts in at a time and they only need around one minute on each side and then they're ready to get up and cool. And I'll just keep continuing that until all of my donuts are fried. to be dipped in some glaze uh, but first I have to make it so here I have some icing sugar some water and my cream from my Oreo cookies and first I will just keep adding in some water stir until I have the thick consistency that I want glaze have now the thickness that I want so I'll just add in my cream from the cookies and just squeeze into the glaze as good as I can there's probably going to be some lumps but that's just cream lumps so I think that is perfectly fine so my donuts are now ready to be dipped into the glaze and I have my crushed Oreos here to put on the top and what I do is just to take a donut here and dip in the glaze and then lift up like so and then I'll just sprinkle some Oreos on top here. Just place them like that and then just a new one, dip in, lift, and some more cookies, just like that and I'll do that to all of them and then they are ready to be served. For my Oreo donuts, and if you want to make these yourself, just go down the description and you can find all the ingredients down there. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel here, and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye!